Mike, first of all, congratulations. What was it like getting the phone call? Number one, who called you, and what was it like getting the phone call? Oh, it was crazy. I mean, just, just, I can't remember who actually called me, though. You know, it was real loud where I'm at. I lost signal. Mm -hmm. I had to run out the building, you know, try to find some, some signal. Actually called the um, coach back. Called decline again. So I got kind of scared after that. But, I mean, after getting on the phone with him and just hearing that they were excited to pick me, you know, it was just an exciting moment for me and my family and friends. How long did it take for you to hear from your from your new quarterback, Phillip Rivers? Uh, he, he texted me that same night, you know, just congratulating me, just telling me he just decided to work with me. You know, yesterday we had your offensive coordinator, your position coach on the show, and he said of all the players he's ever coached, there's no one that has higher character than you as a player and as a person. Yeah, that is, you got to just carry yourself well off the field. You know, that's the main thing, you know, just do the right things off the field. You want to accomplish a lot of things on the field. Where does that come from, that, that type of ethic? Uh, just how I grew up. You know, my grandparents always installed a, like, a good mindset in me. You know, I always wanted to just work on what I wanted to work on, school. I just had goals set it out, so I just got to um, stay focused with that. Yeah, how do you go ahead and how do you go ahead and describe your your kills your your skill set? And you you I mean you want to be your own guy, but who do you who would you compare to in the NFL in today's NFL? Well, I'm a big physical receiver who loves to go catch deep balls. I mean, I look at guys like AJ Green, you know, uh, Dez Bryant, Alshon Jeffrey, uh, guys like that. You know, guys who just dominate on on the, on the edge. What do you know about the organization, about the football team, just in the, in the past 24 hours of getting to study the team? I mean, just everybody um, seems like they're on the same page. You know, everybody's trying to get to the Super Bowl. You know, that's the, that's the goal, win the Super Bowl. So, I mean, everybody focused, you know, just meeting Phillips. You can tell the passion he has for the game. And he's excited to work with me, and I'm excited just to get with the rest of the guys, you know, learn the playbook and just get in their veteran wings and just do good. How many people in, in, in the hometown that you grew up? I think your, your OC said it was, you come from like 400 people or so. How many people? No, it's not even that. It's probably about 150. 150 people? Yeah, so I'm coming from 150 to to this, whatever L.A. population is, it's a lot different, though. How do you make sure that's not going to overwhelm you? I mean, of course you played at Clemson, but how do you make sure that you're going to go from that? This is this is going to be your home for all intents and purposes for the next two know how many years. Yeah, I mean, it's going to be an easy transition for me. It is? I mean, yeah, I don't feel like the big city going to affect me in a bad way. I mean, I feel like it's going to be pretty good. The highest high of your collegiate career at Clemson? Uh, probably winning a national championship. You know, that's... That's probably the only thing, you know, winning a national championship and actually graduating. What's the first when you get some when you get away from this when you get some downtown? What's the first thing you want to do? What's the first thing you want to go ahead and do now that you are a member of the Chargers? Uh, on some downtown. Some downtown. Some downtown. I know you're gonna you're gonna have to study the playbook and you're gonna have some ca the camps and workouts and get to know your team. But what's the one thing you can't wait to go ahead and do? I mean, it's it's been a long long process. You know, I had training. Uh, combine, pro day, meeting with teams, you know, I don't know, maybe take a vacation with my mom or something like that. Yeah. Thank you so much for the time and congrats.